Good evening, friends, fiends, and night owl supremes. Welcome to the other side of a bit late, where tonight I'll be helping you pick out buttons uh, I wear. Don't worry, it won't hurt at all as there'll be no sewing needles tonight. We're just considering all the possibilities. I've assembled quite a few fun options that are simply to die for. Of course, black is traditional, but there's a bit of a twist to these. Some are made of shells and sound simply divine. This model also comes in red if you'd rather stand out from the crowd. And I thought you'd might like to see some square and other shaped options, and teal and purple outliers too. There's a tortoise twist on the classic black, and if that's not enough to persuade you, I've summoned a whole stash of beautiful buttons to peruse with you. Again, there's nothing to decide this evening, we're just entertaining possibilities. And as such, I've made you a magic box that you can revisit again and again. There's a clasp and a hint so you can try on your options before deciding on anything permanent. Each time it opens and closes, another prospect will appear in this wonder here. So now, if you're ready to be regaled and enchanted, sit back, relax, summon your familiars, because second opinions on eyewear are always a smart idea. Get comfy, get cozy, and suspend your suspicion for just a moment. Shall we summon first? It's quite a process, quite an ordeal. Let's just take this bow off, as it's almost time to see what's inside.
do we have in here first? Relax, relax, relax. Yes, the traditional black buttons. And, oh look, they came with pins and thread. Not to worry, not to worry. Let's get these pesky pins out of the picture. I don't want to put you on edge after all. But see, they're harmless, really. Okay, enough, enough. Into the cushion they go. I made a promise after all. I do think these are a great choice because they are glossy on the front, but oh so textured on the other side. These are also special because they have only two instead of the four fastening holes, which means less time stitching. Ah, no, no, no. Just K. 
Can you see the possibilities? These make a delightful duo, front to front, back to back, perfect. Alright, let's just put this possibility to rest, but not before one last sound test. And of course, we're not using this thread tonight, and I'll just make it disappear after this little show and tell. But see, it's harmless, really. Out of sight, out of mind, out of sight, out of mind. What will be revealed next, I wonder?
purple shell button, akin to the glossy black in shape and material, but differing in its matte texture and slightly smaller and irregular size. This would be a great choice for a slight quirky twist on the traditional black, understated but still dark at heart. Here are the original ones, lest you so soon forgotten. See the subtle difference in size and sound? What surprise is in store next? Let's see. Ah yes, a classic. A blood red glossy cherry variant of the already slightly altered black glossy. This one too will reflect the world back with a rose-colored hue. Isn't that positive now? Your glass will always be half full with this ocular accoutrement, and it's classy and sassy. Simply eye-catching and so daring. And again, for a sound comparison, let's call out all the buttons we've sampled so far. What's in store next? Oh, the fantastic square teal. Similar in feel to the purple, it's quite delightfully smooth. But a bit more of an earthy sound on this one to keep you grounded.
This next one has the traditional button shape with the tortoise twist. It's good if you don't want to be like every other person, but still not stand out alone too terribly much. It does help to bring out the complex hues in your eyes, too. Still need more options. That's okay, that's okay. I've got options and we'll find one just right for you. Whatever will you choose? These still need some time to ripen, but you can see hints of what they'll become when it's time. Here's a matching pair of big red dots. Any interest in these? your soul in here somewhere. Thoughts on this pair? Or this detailed purple number? Oh, 
Okay, okay. Undaunted, we persist. I feel compelled to start a nice collection of yellow buttons. Such an innocuous color. <laughs> Sometimes to appreciate what we've got so far, we need to shake things up a bit and see what leaps out.
Again, again, nothing to decide, but let's review our choices. Just put a mental pin in the buttons that you like best, okay? No pressure, nothing to decide, nothing at all to decide. How do you find this teal square? The bold red. The smaller purple. The smaller purple with the red. They do sound nice together. If you're one to have different eyes, I'm all on board. feeling about the tortoise? Of course, if you're lost in the magnetic pool of the glossy black hole, I can hardly blame you. It's hypnotic. It's also traditional for a reason. One or two, black or purple. Purple or teal. Together. No rush, no rush at all.
teal versus the tortoise. Red or teal? or any other button. Again, again, no rush. No need to make up your mind tonight. Just consider the possibilities as always.
This box will be here whenever you need it. You know where to find it. It's not going anywhere, fortunately or unfortunately, however you choose to look at it. But if you know which buttons you'd pick, do let me know in the comments below so I can start preparing them. <laughs> But now, off to sleep and dream what you will, or stay a while and enjoy another sound spell or tale. Whichever you choose, I'll speak to you again, and until then, stay spooky, my friends. Good night. <laughs>